it is Sunday the 4th of July and I am starting my day with a bacon bagel. Now this bagel is 382 calories for it all. I've got a Warburton sesame seed bagel that I've weighed and it came in at 217 calories. I've got two rashers of bacon which I had from Lidl which was 133 calories for the two rashers. I've got 6 grams of clover light for 27 calories and I've also got 5 grams of Lidl's tomato sauce and that is 5 calories making it 382. So I'm off to Tesco's to get a few bits for the week. I will show you what I pick up when I come home and I will see you then. So bye guys. Well that went well. Uh, I, I'm going shopping now to Tesco. My leg is killing. None, Dex has gone to Sunday school, my mother. None of the kids would come with me that were left. Happy to eat all the food, you know. Didn't want to come with me. And to top it off, I said to Warren this morning, I said, oh, I said, come and have a go in this car so in case you know you need to drive it because the plan is he might be able to use mine once or twice a week to save on the old petrol because he's is a guzzler. Well, let's just say we ain't talking now. Break it down. I had to do my usual barking, obviously. But, oh, I can't even say. He's never driven an automatic or an electric car before, so that didn't help. And I'm like, right, don't lose you don't use your left leg and he's sitting there on the drive with his left leg on the pet on the brake and I'm like what are you doing? Alright, I'm only looking, why are you doing that? I'm only and I'm like Wah. 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 Anyway, we only went up the road and back and we were back, we were back home. It's like I'm not driving this car. I don't like it. I don't I don't like it. I don't like it. I feel like I'm closed in, I don't like it. So fine. Don't bother. And then he's like, oh, if I crashed it, never really the end of it. Mm -hmm. No, he wouldn't, but still. Oh well. Maybe we'll try again another day. And I'll just growl instead of barking. There we are. And He's blinking up it up to his Apple iPhone and stuff now. So God knows what's going on. I've got a Samsung Galaxy and I absolutely love it. And he keeps having a go at me, telling me that um, I need an Apple phone. I've got to have an Apple phone. And it's my birthday on the 19th. So if you watch this, Warren, don't go and buy me an Apple phone. Thanks. I don't really do birthdays. We don't really buy for each other. Um... Tesco I've seen whether I can find it in Tesco or not there is a new Hellman's um, cheese sauce out it says it's ideal for burgers and stuff like that it looks like in a mayonnaise type squeezy bottle with where it would be with all those other sauces so I am going to um, see if they've got that. So I'm going to go home. I'll show you what I've picked up in Tesco. I'm then going to make a doner kebab with mints and I've offered to send some up to my sister and my mum. So 
I'm going to make food for them as well. So yeah, I've left the dryer on, the washing machine's on. I hate Sundays, they're so busy. And then I'm back to work tomorrow. I've got my second um, injection tomorrow. <clears throat> so, nice big a jab in the old arm. Yeah, 135. So I'll be finishing work early tomorrow, so I'm not sure what I'll take in to eat because I won't be having my lunch. I might just take a salad in and you can eat it in the car or whatever when I finished. Right, I'm just going past the garage now where I bought the car from. You probably see me going past thinking, oh god, she's not coming in again, is she? However, they did say they'd ring me on Saturday. Did they? No. Did they, Al? Hey, that. And do you know what? In my job, right, if I say to someone I'll ring them, I ring them without fail. In the 21 years I've nearly been there, I've never not rung someone, I've promised. That's a bugbear of mine. Same with manky nails that I did have the other day. Chip nails. Yeah. Don't ring anyone back. Out of order. Because, you know, you say to someone you'll ring them, like I, on Friday, I had this man and I couldn't find out in time the information I needed for him. So I rang him back and I said, I'm just giving you a quick go, go because I'm conscious that I said I'd ring you back and I didn't want really you think I'd forgotten you, you know. Oh, thank you very much, love, you know, blah, blah, blah. Rather than not just ring in, it's rude. It's rude. Rude. Right, I'm nearly at Tesco. I bet it's going to be absolutely rammed here. That's another thing, that put me in a bad mood. I have to clip a few people with a trolley and say, oh, sorry about that, love. I didn't see you there. Ah. <laughs> I don't do that. I might start doing it. Uh, do you know what? I've just had a thought. I better have a mask in this car somewhere. I've been known to come to Tesco. Oh, I've come to Tesco before, right? I've got, um, I've got a phobia. I've got poo phobia, right? Yeah. Poo, 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 poo. I only like to have a poop in my own toilet, right? Because I don't know why. I don't know why, but in my own toilet, right? So I've been known to come to Tesco and then suddenly think, oh my god, I need, I need poo. I need poo. So I sit there for five minutes and jumping up and down thinking, oh my God, oh my God, oh my God. And I start to get the sweats. And then I'm like, nah, I've got to go home. So I go all the way home to have a poo. And I come back again. I was with Dexter last time it happened. And he was like, no, I'm just going to Tesco. I'm like, no way. I'm going to poo in Tesco. Anyway, that's too much information anyway. Just so you know, I don't poo in public toilets. Ever. Not because I'm special, because I just don't like pooing in toilets. Oh, there's a space right there for me. These people are going out the way quick enough. Yes, move, love. Yes, thank you. Because they can't hear the car, they don't move. Oh, that's why his mum make it with I'm not being aggressive. I'm parked. And I look like I'm drugs red back hedge backwards and all. Yeah, got to, I've got to take 30 quid out now for one to put petrol in his car. Well, he could have taken my car tomorrow and that would have saved money. But no, he doesn't like this car, does he? No, he's not going to drive this car. Probably watching this video now saying, oh, I can't believe you said that about me. Mm. Right. Go to Tesco and I will catch you at home to show you what I bought. I've got a list, so I'm not going to be buying um, loads and loads. You watch. My list will get abandoned and now my trolley will be this high. But I want a serious note. I don't need that much. So I'll catch you later. I'm back in the car, I'm boiling. I'm just going to show you a couple of things that you won't see in my haul because I'm dropping them off. 
just eaten two of these. They're four calories a piece. They're really nice. They're like quite um, chunky. Very juicy. Pretty moist. You know, moist. <laughs> moist. Anyway, four calories each. I've just added eight calories to my app because I'm on it this week, girls and boys. A loaf of bread for my mother. Old flossy flu. Got a bit of Tesco finest. Only finest for my mother. 99 calories a slice. Most of straws for a salad, so I picked up that. Caesar salad, Warren's favourite. 419 calories. However, you will see in my haul that. Oh, I'm boiling. You won't see my haul that I'm boiling, I'm just boiling. Yeah, you'll see in my haul that I've bought some Caesar dressing and I bought some new sauces, quite a few sauces actually, that were new. Just for you girls and boys. I know some men watch me. Um, yeah, new sauces. Pizza, Pizza Express ones. Do you like a bit of sauce, you know? So I've got some of them, I'll show you them. Because they were on offer. And I did get some chicken and lettuce and things to make my own Caesar salads for work because me and Warren have been taking in ready-made salads for convenience but when you add it up I can make them a lot cheaper which is obviously better I've seen about saving a bit of money you know so I'm gonna go now to my reverse out now you didn't even hear me start the car did you um, we can go and drop that off to my sister. Oh, beepers are working. And then I'm going to go home and I bought some flatbreads. The fire pit range, it said new. So I thought I would do one of them for lunch and toast it. And then do a bit of chicken, a bit of lettuce, some dressing. You know, a bit of a fancy open flatbread sandwich type thing for lunch. And I'll do everyone the same. Because Dexter should be back by the time I get back, I think. So yeah, so you will see the shopping hall next, followed by some lunch. So I will catch you in the next clip. And I will turn off my phone when I get around the corner. So I am now home with my little stuff. I picked up some plain mini naan breads, 123 calories each. I got some more soft pitters because we're using these tonight. I've already got some brown ones that need eating today, so but I need more than four. So I'll be using one pack of these. These ones are 164 pack and I got two of those. These are the fire pit flatbreads I picked up. It says they're new on there and I'm going to make like an open sandwich with them now. 185 calories per flatbread. These are the sauces I picked up. These ones are new out and so is the Hellman's one. So they are Pizza Express. They are for dipping or for pizzas by the looks of it. It says on there. So we've got garlic and herbs, spicy tomato and chilli and sweet and smoky barbecue. So the garlic and herb one is 360 calories for 100 grams. Spicy tomato, considerably less, 130. And the barbecue is 130 as well. thought that might have been a bit more. So I will be opening one of those today, or two of those. This is the cheese sauce that I picked up, Hellman's cheese sauce. It says it's perfect with burgers, chips and nachos. And 63 calories for 15 grams. I also then got some Caesar dressing. Not had this one before it does i didn't look at the calories on it but it look you know you can just tell when something looks high and it is look but you only need a little bit 607 calories for 100 mil so it's quite high but 
you know, you can have all these things in moderation. I picked up this sauce. It was they've got like a new range of like um I don't know it's like Mexican based stuff there. Um it is a pomegranate sauce. It says it's zesty, tangy, sweet and sour, and it's only twenty three calories for a tablespoon. So I picked that up as well. Got some chips to go with our tea tonight. And these ones you are looking at oven baked 181 400 grams i also picked up a battenberg just so we can have a slice of that after our dinner if i've got enough calories left this one is well an eighth of the cake 122 calories so it's not going to be a massive slice Gonna be like a little slither, but for 122 calories, that's not bad. Easy peelers, I'll stick on screen typical calories in an easy peeler. Cocoa pot bars just for kids to take to school for their break, or they can have one at breakfast time. 84 calories for Cake one. bars to go in the kids' pack lunches and for us to take to work. 104 calories for one. And these are only 47 pence a pack, and the bars are individually wrapped, so they're good. 97 calories for orange Jaffa cake bars, and 93 for the black currant. I also got my husband some coffees to take to work, 40 calories a mug. I got some of these because they were on offer for a pound. We love these. 199 for the two. So they're really nice. These desserts, 211 calories each. I think they're new. They're on offer. And they come in like a glass pot. And it's like sponge mousse and creamy. Indulgent caramel cappuccino. So yeah, I picked up those. I picked up two t-shirts for Dexter and Jackson. Just like polo top. And then a black and white one. Because they are fast growing out of their clothes. And considering they're only 8 and 9, they're in 10 to well, 11. A loaf of Tiger Bay bread. And it is 117 for typical slice. However, I would weigh that. Chocolate chip brioche rolls for the kids. 123 a roll. I also picked up some trainers. Dexter needs some trainers. So I just got those. And she, um, obviously there's a lot of people nicking clothing and shoes because I had to prove I'd paid for them before she'd take the tag off. And I made some sort of joke and she basically said, yeah, loads of people are nicking them. So that's a shame, isn't it? Anyway, I got some aromatic baby leaf salad. I've got two packs of these. This is for tonight and half the pack's only 19 calories. I also picked up some Wild Rocket. We're going to have some of that with our lunch now, I think. And this one is only, well, 100 grams, 22 calories, but seven, 30 grams is only 7 calories. So that's good. I also got some of these romaine heart lettuces to make Warren a Caesar salad. We've got... Some mini vine leaves. I only tried these a few months ago for the first time and they're really nice. My boss in work has them and I'm always like, oh, they look nice. So I finally got another pack. Quarter of the pack is 99 calories. I got some sweet chili chicken breasts to do sandwiches for the kids for their pack lunch. 104 calories for half the pack. I also picked up some toilet roll. Everybody needs toilet roll. And I've run out of kitchen foil, so I've got some more kitchen and foil. The last few bits I got, I picked up some semi-skim milk. I'll stick that on screen, what the uh, typical values are for that. I got two packs of Snack and Jacks. They were on offer, 78 calories per bag. So I had two of those. I also picked up some mini... Cheddar's Red Leicester, and these are 132 a bag. I got some chicken and chorizo koftas. You can have two koftas for 97 calories. 
we've got some bacon and this bacon you were looking at two rashers 180 calories some fresh strawberries i'll stick on screen what strawberries are same with some salad tomatoes and then the last two things i've got some chicken breast slices which we're going to use now in our lunch quarter of the pack is 103 and then lastly these were on the end of the aisle on offer and they look nice and sound nice whether i'll get to have one or not who knows because the kids tend to nick everything like this out the fridge before i get my hands on it Let's have a look at the calories on these they are 182 for 100 grams and the pots are 100, 100 grams. Yeah, so the whole thing, 182 a pot. So that is everything I have bought. I don't know what I've done with the receipt. I think it comes to £77 anyway, but I only have three bags. But yeah, that is it. And I will catch you in the next clip for lunch. So this is what I'm having for my lunch today. It's 365 calories. I will stick a breakdown on the screen showing exactly what is there and i have got some of the pomegranate sauce on there and there is a flatbread underneath you can just see it there so yeah it's like an oakland chicken salad sandwich so this is the donna meat i've made with mince and i've just sliced it up and i'm now going to serve it up end up having the donna meat that i made i was busy i ended up in the garden sorting out my flower pots so i've ended up with some cereal so this bowl of cereal is crunchy nut cornflakes tesco zone and milk it's actually 700 calories and i would have no problem just having a bowl of cereal when i was hungry a big bowl like this so yeah that is what I'm having. I've got 255 calories left. Probably won't use those now. Back to work tomorrow and I'm having my second jab in the afternoon. So I will see you then. So thanks for watching guys. Bye.